that's the one right here. She's letting him have it. I'm here to talk about this, but that's more interesting. Can y'all hear that? <laughs> She's cussing him out. She's letting him have it. We are at World's, the World's Fair Park in Knoxville, Tennessee. And no, I'm not taking you here yet. We're talking about this guy. He is a famous Russian composer known as Romaninov, I believe I'm pronouncing that correctly. Forgive me if I'm not. I cannot roll my R's like traditionally you're supposed to in Russian. I sound more like, I sound like an idiot. So, Romaninov. So, there, I made myself sound like an idiot for you guys. Got Heather here with me. We're out just enjoying the day. Enjoy the nice, beautiful day here. So I asked her earlier, I said, have you heard of Romaninov? What did you say? I said, yeah, they said about him on the Willy Wonka. So yeah, apparently- Willy Wonka referenced him. So apparently is referenced on the 70s version, right? Not yeah. the new one. The Gene good Wilder version, version, the Gene Wilder version, that's the best version. She don't watch the new one, she's against it. But anyways, that's, what, that's how she knew of this composer. I did not know about him. I did some research, found out more that this was even here. I wanna show it to you guys. It's the only statue in the world of this composer. And the reason it's here is unfortunately, he came here to do a concert in a gymnasium here in Knoxville. And it was his last concert he ever done. He actually passed away right after that. And one of the last, is it sonnet or just numbers? I don't know how you say it. Um, but numbers. one of the numbers he did, and I think it's one of the last ones he did, included the funeral march, which is kind of ironic. But that happened right before he passed away. Maybe he did it every time, I don't know, but it's still kind of got that weird sense of irony. It's got a logo with his last, with his initial on it and like the candle light above it there, which I think is a pretty cool looking logo. And it's a nice little monument here to a legendary composer. He is clutching to his piano, as you see here. Let's walk around and see the back side of this. Any other neat details, you can see he's wearing his tux. And standing here on his platform next to a piano. And it is lighted. So, it's a beautiful day here at the park with Heather, hanging out, just, just enjoying a beautiful day. Hope y'all like this. I like doing these little historic tidbits places that nobody really knows about so we'll be going here next so hopefully you like this guys i hope you please like share subscribe if you want to send some money on patreon i'd be happy to send you a postcard and that funds will be used for future travels bigger endeavors we plan on doing more road trips don't we mm -hmm. bigger better road trips we want to go all over the country so and maybe outside the country too so thanks for watching guys Love y'all. Till next time, you have a good day.